I hope the meal was to your liking. Not since we left Persia have we reclined in such comfort or tasted such wine. You've been a most gracious host. But we've not traveled so far to taste the lamb or sample the fruit of the vine. Where's the one born king of the Jews? We, we expected to find him here in your palace. Alas, we have no knowledge of such a child. Uh, you mentioned a star. Where did you find it, and how did you know it's me? We are astrologers. We follow the events of the sky, always tracking, always searching to discover what there is to be known. But how did you know this star meant a child was to be born, a king, and why here in Judea? Fetishazar, the one the Jews named Daniel, left many writings of the visions given to him by his God. Also the writings of other Jewish prophets. It was foretold a king would be born in this very time. But to travel so far, to follow the heavens? If you had seen the star, you would not doubt. <laughs> it is surprising we have not seen this star here in Jerusalem. <laughs> yes, that is surprising. So where will you go now? How will you know what to do? We will continue our travels and uh, await the star's guidance. If it does not appear, we will return to Persia, none the wiser. And when did you first see the star? Almost a year has passed. You have committed an entire year to this quest? To see God on Earth? Who would not travel to the fulfillment of one's journey? Ah, yes, who not? When you find this child, you must return here to Jerusalem and tell me of his whereabouts, so that I may go and worship him as well. When will you leave? As soon as you give us your leave, King Herod. Night has already fallen. <laughs> ah, yes. When else would one travel who follows the stars? <laughs> you, you do not believe, do you? I am a philosopher. <coughs> I ponder many wondrous and not so wondrous things. Gods, I leave to the religious men. It is getting late, and it is time for us to continue our journey. Go then, and look carefully for the child. When you find him, return here and inform me of his whereabouts, so that I may go and worship him as well. Your hospitality has been most appreciated. Ave, my honored guests. My guards will take you and your entourage to the Western Gate. <coughs> will you have them followed? No. It might make them suspicious. And besides, Magi live by their own code. They will return. And if they do not? We know the prophecies as well as they. Either way, my eye turns towards Bethlehem. 